I'm Amina Kermanowski, um, Hair Transplant Coordinator at the Dr. Lambs Institute for Hair Restoration. I have been doing hair restoration for 14 years, and I would like to talk to you about today um, quality control. I have been doing hair transplantation for 14 years, and I have seen some physicians in years ago starting to add hair restoration to their practice, thinking that is easy to do. Um, I happen to be a good cook, and I compare hair restoration to cooking where anybody can chop vegetables, but not everybody can be a good chef. So what we do differently here is we pay attention to quality control. For more than 10 years, I have been um, teaching and training physicians and assistants hair restoration and also providing quality control for a company in Canada and the United States. I have been lecturing at the International Society for Hair Restoration about um, graft dissection and also quality control. Last year I made a, a poster presentation where in details we explained what we do differently and what is important in achieving great hair restoration. Let's talk about quality control today. Graft dissection, graft handling and graft placements are three most important factors in achieving good quality hair restoration. Uh, hair normally grows in groupings, families of hair called follicular units, and graft dissection is performed in such a way to be respectful toward these follicular units. If follicular units, they are like a families of, he of hairs, uh, if they are dissected or destroyed, the hair growth will be impaired and the result will be a poor and less what than expected. If hair transplantation is performed in careless way, which means grafts are left to, die, to dry, then hair growth will be once again impaired. And the last thing we want to talk about is that if grafts are handled appropriately, damaged dur during the dissectional transplantation, hair restoration will be um, affected. Graft dissection is complex process where grafts have to be kept moist and the hair follicular units have to be respected. During the graft dissection, the assistant can damage graft by poorly manipulating grafts, and which will uh, end with kinky or poor kinky hair or poor growth. The importance of paying attention to graft handling uh, is in regard to how natural hair growth will be after hair start growing after the, uh, the result is achieved. What we notice if grafts are handled improperly, if the grafts are uh, squeezed, hair will grow kinky and will not match naturally surrounding hair. If grafts are let to dry out like flowers, hair will not grow. If follicular units are destroyed, then some of the hairs that you wear in a follicular unit will die out and therefore there will, they will be a poor hair growth. So for these reasons it is very important to pay attention to quality control during the hair restoration. I have personally trained every member, every team member at the Lame Institute for Hair Restoration and we take pride in what we do. Differently than some places, um, do hair restoration where assistants are sitting in a back room and just cutting grafts not knowing the patient and who grafts belong to. Uh, we uh, stay in a room in a proximity with the patient, create a bond with the patient and therefore uh, take personal pride in what we do and also personal responsibility that our grafts are uh, handled properly and therefore take uh, personal interest in the results. I hope that this short uh, primer on hair restoration and quality control in hair restoration can help you understand the importance of good work and what makes a difference in, between any hair restoration and a good results.